Hi, I'm Asha from Skate Fresh and welcome to Brighton. I am here today with Lucas from Melbourne. Hi, Lucas. How are you going? So I'm good. <laughs> so I'm very excited for this session. So we're going to do a bit of um, laser coaching with Lucas. But before we do that, tell me a little bit about your skating. What kind of skating do you do? A um, bit of everything. So I, I grew up skating in the 90s and skated for you know, a few years before I sort of you know, got a car and gave up and you know, got old and fat. <laughs> and then I picked it up again. Like back then we used to just do you know, everything. You know, we used to go to the skate rink every week. Mm -hmm. We used to skate around the streets. If we were going somewhere, we had our skates on our feet, jumping off stairs, riding stairs, grinding rails, Which all that sort of stuff. Which you're still doing the, today, aren't Which, you? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Okay, so what we're going to look at today, hopefully, is some slides. Yep. So you're generally working on different kinds of slides and probably combos of slides. Yeah. Do you do the um, porn star or star slide? I can, sort of. Yeah. All right, why don't we start there? Yep. I like I, When something's a sort of, <laughs> I feel like there might be something I could do to help. Cool. So let's start with that. Normally called the porn star slide, but now being renamed the star slide for obvious reasons. So let's start yep. there. That's not nice. All right, do another one. I've never seen you do that before. Right, I thought you were just figuring out your leg. There we go. Okay, so I've seen that happen a couple of times where it doesn't quite bite, right? So imagine that, so the distance you're putting your foot down is about a skate length. See if you can make it two. So what do you have to do to this knee? Come and grab hold of the fence when you're doing it statically. But what do you have to do to this knee to get that leg further away? bend it more and straighten that knee. The straighter it is, the further away that leg gets. Yeah. So if you can have this moment where you kind of extend and try and get that leg further away, it shallows the angle, you get more slide, right? Have a go. So more knee bend, think of placing the foot far away, and then it slides every single time. But see if you can flex the sliding foot as opposed to point it. Flex, there you go, yeah? I do it once more, I think you're not, Right, so you could, you're, you're getting a little bit diagonal with that foot. So you want to you wanna take the heel more around the corner. Yeah. Come and hold on to the edge for a second, because there's another part of this, which is if you don't turn your hips. So can you see the difference in angle? If you just stick your leg behind you, the angle is about this. If you turn, so try and actually move your butt cheeks towards the fence. There you go, there's 90 degrees. Yeah. But again, just watch that excessive outside edge. Yeah, yeah, try and get your support. I mean, you want a bit of outside edge, but not too much, all right? So have a go at turning your butt towards the wall. Yes, that's more 90, exactly. Okay, so why don't you change shoulder before you go in? So, you know, set up here, then turn shoulder, then go in. Yeah. There you go, that's, that's much better. Have you tried comboing the star slide with anything else? So how about power slide into stars? So you could go power slide, invert, exactly. Now the trick with that is you're probably going to be able to slide with quite a high angle because your power slide is very fluent. As you twist everything and go into the star, see if you can also go down on that support knee. So there's a, I think there's a moment of up on the change, but then you've got to sink back down on the support leg. Nice! Very nice. It's, you can see how very few people do that one, yeah? Um, I haven't even done that one before. I'm just... Now, do you involve... You do have to change your head, don't you? Sorry, I've never done this before. I want to try. And I've got my arm above my head. <laughs> it's just what you did. Nice. And again, you're doing exactly what I just did, which is the trailing arm is coming up. Yeah. And if the trailing arm is coming up, the knee's coming up with it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think about it as the arms going kind of down, down and long. Yeah. Right down here is going to really support you. Arms down. Almost. Almost. I still think it's that distance that's crept into being short again. Yeah. It's looking like something that's going to be amazing in a couple of months. <laughs> yes, nice. Awesome. Good job. Cheers. That was good. I like it. Um, we're going to look at a few more different slides now and maybe some other slide combos. Yeah, because that's just two slides. Yeah, let me, let me get two more of those. Two more. All right. He's not satisfied. He knows he can do better. All right, let's have a go.
almost. Again, turn the hip. Yeah, you've got to turn the hip. And turn. There you go. That was it. That was it. And I reckon that's not, that's not going to take long to be made fluent. Excellent. Good. I look forward to seeing that when I'm next in Australia. Right, let's have a look at a few more, shall we?